Hello. We are going to um, do some calculations with Excel. This is going to help you with your assignment for LP3. As you can see, I have the data values in A1 through A10. These are not the same data, data values in your assignment, so make sure you change the numbers. I wrote down maximum, minimum, mean deviation, variance, standard deviation, and last one is range. We are going to use we are going to use the maximum and minimum to calculate the range. I'm going to show you how to do it in Excel, but you can also use it do it with your calculator. So let's go to a blank cell. I'm going to go to uh, cell E1 and I'm going to hit equal max parentheses A1 A10. Put A1 through A10 because that's where my data values are. Um, your data values may go past uh, A10. They may go through A15. So you have to make sure you put in the right range of numbers or cell numbers for your calculations. So my data values are in A1 colon A10 and then I'm going to hit enter. And I get a maximum value of 35. So that means the largest data value in my data set is 35. Now I'm going to do minimum. I'm going to hit equal min parentheses A1 colon A10. Don't forget to put the colon in there. And then I'm going to hit enter and I get the minimum value is 18. So the smallest data value in our data set is 18. For mean deviation you're going to hit equal AVE DEV. AVE means average. And um, average and mean same, mean, they mean the same thing. So you're going to put A V E D E V parentheses A1 colon A10 and hit enter. And I get 3.5. For the variance, I'm going to hit equal var, V A R, parentheses A1 colon A10. Enter. And then we have standard deviation. We're going to hit equal S T D E V. And as you can see, in some of these Excel programs, I guess it depends on what Excel program that you have. I have the very the newest one. I'm not sure what number it is. But uh, as you can see, once you start typing out the command or the function, some of the information will come up and it will guide you on how to enter the data. So as you can see, it says STDEV and then it says number one, uh, number two. So that's when you just put in your data values. So Excel will guide you through. And if, and if you still can't figure it out, you can always uh, go through the help program. So you get 5.034327. Now to calculate the range, you can use um, Excel. Like I said, you can use a calculator. Uh, what I am going to do is I'm going to hit equal, and then I'm going to take the maximum value. In this case, it's E1. And then I'm going to subtract off, put a minus sign, the minimum value, which is E2. The range is just the minimum from the maximum. And I hit enter and I get 17. Okay. So make sure that when you go through your assignment, you switch your numbers. Um, also make sure you go through the manual and uh, highlight the advantages, the disadvantages, and the characteristics of each one of these. If you have any questions, you're free to email me.